Hi, welcome to this video. My name is Kevin. I am the Information Officer for the Adult Education Service in Balbriggan. In this video series, I interviewed some of our current part-time students who shared their experiences of returning to education. They discussed the benefits of returning to education, some of the concerns they had before beginning their courses, supports that are available to adult learners, as well as practical tips and advice they would give to people who are considering returning to education. In this video, I spoke with Angelica. Angelica explained how studying part-time, three mornings per week, fits in with her busy family life. Are you studying part-time or full-time at the moment? It is a part-time course. We're doing three days a week. Three days a week. Brilliant. And would that be kind of morning time, afternoon or kind of evening times? It's the morning times. We're doing um, Wednesday and um, Friday. We have 9.30 till 1 o'clock. And then on Thursdays, we have 9.30 till half 11. Very good. So it's almost like they are kind of up, and, like up early and the lessons are almost done early in the day. So you can probably have the rest of the day to yourself. Or Yeah, with the timings, it's very handy because the children have to be in school for nine o'clock. So you yeah. have the time to come back home, have a quick cup of tea or whatever, like get yourself ready for the class before 9.30. And then, yeah, they finish early. So you still have time to even after class do your assignments. And then, yeah, the children come back from school. Angelica also spoke about how she stays in touch with her tutors and classmates during COVID-19 restrictions. How would you kind of, have you managed to stay in contact with your tutors and classmates uh, while learning from home? Um, when it comes to the tutors, like I said earlier, yeah, we email or okay. um, talk. You can ask them, can, um, can they come online for a Zoom meeting if you have something you're really worried about? Yeah. So you can uh, ask them to come online and uh, they'll make a private meeting with you anytime you need it. And when it comes to other classmates, we actually made our own Facebook group where we keep in touch with each other and uh, we help each other out with our work and stuff like that. Angelica also spoke about the supports that are available to adult learners. And what type of supports are available to you uh, while doing the course? And this could be anything from the tutors, the student liaison officer to even support with IT or support from your classmates. Well, the support is amazing. Yeah. Because, yeah, if to do with your course, you can just email your tutor. Most of the time they get back to you pretty quickly. Brilliant. Within, the, obviously, nine to five. Yeah. Um, if you have any other uh, queries, like you can get onto Cathy. Yeah. Um, and she's brilliant. She gets back onto you straight away with every information you might need. So, yeah, I've never had a problem with communication or support or anything like that. Anytime I needed something, I had it. Angelica also offered excellent practical advice around assignments, which are a part of accredited courses. Do your work week by week. Be, no, don't leave it for the last moment because it is overwhelming because um, you could get an assignment that's due in four weeks. So you're doing a bit of work every week. Yes. Yeah. So you don't want to be left at the very end. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found the information in this video useful and helpful. 